Ahoy friends, welcome to Building the Alpha Dory. I'm Dan and today we're in Harold Burnham's sail loft with uh, John the sailmaker putting together the Alpha Dory's mainsail. I was six afraid of seven because it had to calculate a broad seam.
up? Let me move the. Uh... Oh, you're all here. Oh, oh yeah. Straight. Hey. And I didn't know who was going to be up here. <laughs> uh, everything working? Yeah. Great. I saw you put the windows in. Yeah. You get a fire going? Yeah, we got we a did. box of dead finches for you. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, yeah this. this uh, those birds, they. They, they burn right up. <laughs> Did you burn them? No, nah. I took them out first. Well, I usually just throw them in there. I'll put them back in. All right, perfect. Yeah, it's, it's just crematorium. Yeah. Yeah, yeah the first uh, fire of the year, you have to burn up six or eight birds. Rich, ritual sacrifice. It's hard to believe that that many birds would be dumb enough to go down that thing and die like that. that there are worse ways to go. Are they seeking go. heat, do you think? So, are they what? Do you think they're seeking heat or something? Uh, no, they they, they they like to go in the holes uh, and they somehow get into that chimney and then they fall down the chimney and they can't fly out. Mm -hmm. So they wind up against the stove door just beating themselves oh, to death and dying. It's really probably not a very pleasant way to go. But, yeah. yeah, every year there's a staff Really? Wow. Well. It's a Christmas miracle. <laughs> Where'd you put them? In that box on the chair to your right. <laughs> the urn. <laughs> oh. I'll throw that on the fire outside. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whole box, I won't open it. <laughs> we'll disturb their grave. Yeah, this is, now, now, now this place is haunted. Ah, so you found the sale plan now? We did, we did. And I, look, I matched it up to... um. What the pictures I took on my phone and saw that that was like the, the final draft. So I I did a what I think was the right broad seaming and that would be fine. I, I I sort of looked at I found a mizzen that you drew and was like trying to match it. That's uh, yeah I don't think the the broad seams are that scientific. Let me get all over the place. So the acorn to Arabella guys came. Yeah. And uh, I don't know if you saw it or not, but I'm famous on the internet. Mm -hmm. On YouTube. We saw and it. And I'm just like talking to them, and they, they, let, they took out a lot of it. Thank God they edited it. <laughs> but um, they just have to so, be saying. Just so you know, you're on YouTube right now. I think you should probably turn that off. <laughs> yeah. Am, am I being videoed on YouTube? No. Shut up then. No. Uh, I, I, I never even know. Like, I've. You ain't said anything. Sailing and Dan will just right. have the phone going and I'll just, just be rambling. And like, pause it? Yeah. Okay. I'll yeah, be so swearing. Wait, so what are you going to say? <laughs> <laughs> so this guy, this guy the, the, first off, there was two guys. One was the videographer and the other one was the boat builder. <laughs> and the videographer was the, was the adult in the room. He was like, kind of a grown up. And, and, the, and the boat builder was like, and, yeah. and, and they had an ugly divorce this year, and the boat builder wound up with a boat, and the videographer wound up leaving. And this woman came in that, that the boat builder hired to be the videographer. Oh, wow. So, and, 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 and the guy just knows less than nothing. And his big boasting thing is he has no experience. And he just yeah. listens to all of the wrong advice. And uh, so at one point, they they said, well, it's not like you're going to use Oceanus. And I'm like, well, 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 why not? I kind of work exclusively in Oceanus, but if you want to make it out of something else, you'll have to go somewhere else. And then he's talking all about roll of furling. And she's like, he's not going to get on the end of that bowsprit. And I said, don't you? They put this on the video. They said, I said, don't you climb fucking mountains? You know? <laughs> what is the matter with you? You know? So, anyway. Wow. Yeah. 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 How would you even put a roller furler on the end of that bowsprit? Well, anyway. you could do it. I said to him. I, said, I literally just hung three roller furlers over a girl in Clifford this week. So you can put a roller furling wherever you want. Thank you. 
outside right now and I've got a few outside. Yeah. Okay, because this is like, I can, like in terms of this, I, I was going to flake this down, make pencil marks on the alls, and then just, you know, no, no, leave it. it. Just keep working here okay. and using it as you see fit. The only one that's used the space, and the only time the space has been used since, like, I guess I finished the sale in August, the mm -hmm. July. Can I hold a corner for you guys? Yeah. Alright. Oh, look at that. A sail is born. So, like, it's perfect. That over there. Look at that. And, uh, 
That's a sale. Okay, let's add a little bit. Let's see where the shape is. Do the thing. That's the luff, right? Yeah. yeah, so it's right. So good. There's the pocket right there, the forward. Yeah. Forward edge. Mm -hmm. Ha! Nice work. Let's make her up. Baking from scratch. Okay. All right, well, thanks for stopping by building the Alpha Dory, folks. This is uh, a mainsail sewn together. And uh, yeah, thanks for all of the uh, likes, comments, subscribes, and all that. And without your support, this channel isn't possible. So thanks for stopping by, and we'll see you next video. Bye. <laughs>